Marine ecosystems are one of the largest and most delicate ecosystems on earth due to their varied biodiversity. They are also very important to us. Almost half of the world's oxygen is produced by the phytoplankton in the ocean and they also take in carbon dioxide, reducing chances of global warming. Marine ecosystems are also new and potential sources for medicine. The marine ecosystem is invaluable for its resources. Unfortunately, we humans do not consider this and instead try to please our selfish desires. We don't even value these ecosystems for their plant and animal life and instead do whatever pleases us. This has led to the inevitable decline of numerous species in the ecosystem. One of those important species under threat has been the inspiration to many horror movies, sharks. Sharks are a vital cog in the marine ecosystem and not the human killing machines they are portrayed as. In fact, humans are the shark killing machines. Sharks kill only 12 humans per year while humans kill around 100 million sharks per year. We kill them in the cruel practice of shark finning. Shark finning is the removal of shark fins from the shark while in the sea, while the rest of it is dumped into the sea, usually alive and since it cannot move, it sinks to the bottom and dies due to suffocation or predators. However, if the sharks are brought to shore and then finned, it is not considered shark finning since officials on shore can check and regulate the amount of sharks caught. This is shark finning. This, however, isn't. So what are they killed for? Shark fin soup. Shark fin soup is considered a delicacy and a symbol of wealth and prosperity. They are mostly served at wedding banquets and high profile occasions. Not serving it at these occasions is considered an insult. One bowl of soup can cost around 100 US dollars, which is 6,676 Indian rupees. That can cost a four membered family a month worth of meals. Due to shark finning, the numbers of some shark species have reduced by 80% in the last 50 years. This can have a catastrophic effect on the ecosystem. According to a study in North Canada, the decline of great sharks increased the population of ray below them, who therefore started to eat more of bay scallops till there were no more, forcing the bay scallop fishery to close. If this continues, so many fisheries all around the world will shut down, leading to increased unemployment. So what's the solution? As individuals, we could boycott restaurants that are known to sell shark fin soup. By doing this to many restaurants, they will have to remove their soup from the menus, leading to a decrease in demand for sharks and shark fin, which will reduce the money given to fishermen for catching sharks, discouraging them and finally making them stop catching sharks altogether. A similar success story is when Hong Kong Disneyland removed shark fin soup from their wedding banquet menu due to many environmentalists from diverse places threatening to stay out of its parks all over the world, even though shark fin soup is a sought after delicacy in China. Awareness is another major factor in discouraging shark finning. Public awareness advertisements in countries like Thailand and Singapore have reduced the consumption of shark fins by 25%. We can also create awareness by spreading the word to other people in our home, apartment, neighborhood and school through various mediums like posters, documentaries, and talks. So from what we have seen, shark finning is threatening sharks all over the world. They have a huge role in the ecosystem and even support many lives through fisheries. It is not our right to take away their lives and fins away from them. The best we can do is to mend our ways and let the sharks live in safety, just like us.